Okay, now that we kind of have an understanding of the different types of uh, stencils there are and stuff for this process, we're going to go ahead and prep this uh, uh, Bulgarian milled receiver. This is an uh, this is a SLR 100 receiver uh, made made in Bulgaria. Uh, you could the sides already been uh, polished up by myself, and uh, the, the black tape right here is over the serial number. So we have a little stencil here and it is the Bulgarian Circle 10 logo and uh, we had to, I had to cut it up really small for this be, so that I could uh, effectively tape it on here uh, with it as large as it was uh, originally it uh, no no space for me to tape it on so it's gonna be a little bit more of a challenge but we should be able to do it okay got the uh, red hooked up to the part and we've got the black hooked up to the marker and this is a deep etch carbon head as we talked about before so I have electrolyte solution filled into the reservoir here which is going to keep it uh, saturated so, go ahead and, press it. and right now with doing this I can feel you can feel it through the marker feel the buzzing and now you can hear and at least I can hear it and see bubbling here here in a second I'm gonna put you down at a closer angle so you can get really close up and see it uh, and what's going on all right so now let's peel this off Ooh, it's a little warm there you go a really nice uh, circle 10 etch. It'll look even better when I uh, do a quick blast on it. That'll really uh, crispen the edges up a lot more, although it's pretty crisp right now. Alright, and next we're going to use this uh, other stencil I made with the uh, Bulgarian selector markings. And there we go. We'll take the tape and stencil off and take a look at it. And there you have it. One Bulgarian selector mark. That looks really good. Really good.